two years, three years after they've had the injections, their spike antibodies are over 25,000. I mean, massive, which shows they're still producing it, it's still there in their bodies, you know. And then that's why I was so delighted to find augmented NAC and, to, and I recommend it to all my patients because we have to get rid of all the triggers, whatever they may be, whether that's people living in a moldy house, whether that's having high histamine foods or whether it's clearing the spike protein from their bodies. And we need to eliminate that as efficiently and as quickly as we can. And certainly the augmented NAC does that. So thank you very much to the Zero Spike Project for all their efforts and hard work and their tenacity not to give up, mm. to find something that could get rid of it. So the the augmented NAC, it, de, it detaches, it, it's three Ds. It detaches the spike protein from the ACE2 receptors. Now, the ACE2 receptors aren't just on the surface of the mast cells. They are, there's a lot there, but they're also on the lining of the circulatory system. So all the endothelial lining of our arteries and ar arterioles and veins and everything are full of ACE2 receptors. So the little spike proteins start attaching to those. It's in all of our organs. ACE2 receptors are everywhere. So the augmented NAC will detach the spike protein from the ACE2 receptors. It then denatures it. It splits it into six sections. And they have, with mass spectrometry, they have got diagrams of exactly where and which bonds it breaks. And it's reproducible. And it breaks those bonds so that the spike protein, which is a very complex protein, is now in six pieces. And the liver can then detoxify, that's the third D, and eliminate these pieces into the urine. They've developed a urine test, which is available in Italy and in America, but not yet in the UK and other parts of Europe. We're hoping that it's going to be very soon, where you can see the detox metabolites of the spike protein in the urine. And when they checked people's urine before giving them the augmented NAC, there was no there were none. And then when they gave it augmented NAC one, three times a day for seven days, on day eight, they checked the urine and it was full of the uh, these particles, these metabolites. Uh. And they checked every week and they found at three months it started to really reduce. So that's why they say one, three times a day for three months. Thanks for watching this video on our YouTube channel. If you want to listen to the full episode, you can do by subscribing to the Radical Health Rebel podcast using the QR code on the screen. Or if you like me, you prefer to watch the full episode, you can subscribe to our Substack using the QR code on the screen right now.